Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. All right, if you are new here, my name's Kaylee and I have an unhealthy obsession with cow pack. So today I thought I would talk about um, three of my cow pack bags that I have. Um, now that I've traveled with them, I've had a chance to really use them and I wanna give you my thoughts um, about each of these three bags. And I also want to say, before I go any further, I do make other content, so uh, feel free to check it out, I would love that. Um, but let's go ahead and jump into these three bags. Okay, so the first bag I thought I would talk about has actually ended up to unfortunately be my least favorite. And that is the Luca backpack. Um, I took this bag with me to Texas when I went in January. And I'm going to link the video for you so you can see it. I don't know that I actually um, talked about packing this bag. But I think it makes an appearance in this video. So you can check that out. Um, but here's what I don't like about this bag. I felt like I could not fit anything in this bag. Once I had put my laptop in the laptop sleeve, which is this back pocket here, once I had put my laptop in there, I felt like this second pocket, I could not fit anything else in this pocket, hardly anything. Um, I think I managed to end up putting my... I had a couple of snacks, I put my iPad in here, and a couple hair clips. I think that was pretty much it. And my work laptop is a bit thicker, it's a Dell, it's not a Mac or anything like that. But I put the charger in the shoe compartment, and I don't know if that's what made the bag feel really full, or the charger was, but when I went to zip this compartment, it was like, I couldn't even hardly zip it. Like I really had to use some force to zip that part of the bag. So I'm not sure what was going on with that. Um, but that is one thing I didn't like. The other thing I did not like is this, I am gonna call it a water bottle pocket. On the side is so small, especially when you get things in the bag or when you put your water bottle in, it's so tight. I did not like that. Two things that I did like about this bag. Number two, number one, I'm sorry, is that it's a backpack. So you have your weight evenly distributed if you're wearing this as a backpack and not with the trolley sleeve. The second thing that I liked was the hidden pocket on the trolley sleeve, there is a zipper pocket. Let me see if I can give you a better view. So there is a hidden pocket here. I did like that. I put my bag on the handle of my suitcase and it was easy for me to get my phone, my wallet with my um, driver's license and everything out of this pocket. Um, the other thing I will say, give this bag some credit, is that it has held up really well. I've used this a couple times. I'm actually thinking that I might transition this to my work bag um, because I have a tote right now and it's just, I'm tired of carrying it on one shoulder. So those are my thoughts about the Luca backpack. One more thing to say about the Luca backpack. This is the 15 inch. So you might have better luck with the 17 inch. I'm not sure what the dimensions are this way, but if you're looking to use this as a travel bag, that, you know, this was just my experience. Um, I do think it's a great bag. I wouldn't tell anyone don't purchase it, but I do also wanna be, you know, upfront and honest about what my experience was. I wonder, I don't know, I might like traveling with the 17 inch better, but this is just my experience with the 15. Okay, the next bag, um, 
I'm very conflicted about <laughs> these two. Not because I don't like them, I love them both, but I don't know how to determine which bag is my favorite. I think I like them both for different reasons, which I'll talk about, but I think the next bag we'll talk about is the laptop tote. So one thing for me in a travel bag is I, personal preference, I prefer a dedicated laptop sleeve. So that is why I like this bag. Why I don't like this bag is this is your only way to carry it. This is it. There is not an option for a crossbody. So I don't like that. I do like that it has the trolley sleeve. What I don't like about the trolley sleeve is that it's so long. That, you know, that's good and bad, but when I'm using this as my personal item and I have my driver's license, my wallet, whatever in this back pocket, it did feel like I kind of had to dig for it. What alleviates that is this small pocket here on the bag. However, it's a pretty small pocket. So let me show you, this is my iPhone. Let me take all my stuff out. But this is my iPhone 13 Pro Max. If I put it in this pocket, it still sticks out. Not a huge deal, but just something to be aware of um, when you're traveling. So the other thing that I enjoyed about this bag um, is the expanding nature of the bag. Um, I really liked that because I felt less stressed about if I bought something or um, if I needed you know, to fit something else in this bag, if I had a water bottle, whatever. That hits on another thing I did not enjoy about this bag. Um, no water bottle. People have talked about using this back um, pocket, the one on the trolley sleeve, as a water bottle pocket, and you totally could do that. Um, but again, I really don't have anything negative to say about this bag. I really liked it. I enjoyed traveling with it. Um, I didn't have any anything negative other than those two very small things. So. I do really love this bag. I love this chocolate color. This bag and the Luca bag are both chocolate and I really, really love it. So I would recommend this bag for sure. All right, now let's talk about what could be CalPAC's most popular bag and that is the Luca. Okay, so if you want to see me packing this bag, you can check out this video um, and it's a little bit chaotic but I did kind of go back and forth between packing the regular Luca and the large Luca and let me tell you you do not realize how big that large Luca is until you put it, well, I didn't anyway, until I put it on my carry-on bag. And I was like, oh, yeah, that's not a personal item. There is no way that is going to pass as a personal item. So um, <laughs> the large Luca for me is a true weekend bag. But this original Luca is a really good um personal item bag and overnight bag. So I've used this for air travel and I've used it for um, just, you know, going somewhere for a night or a weekend, two nights, whatever. So pros of this bag. I love the two options to carry it. So you have your crossbody strap and you have your regular shoulder straps. So I really like that. The other thing that I really like about the Luca is the water bottle pocket on the side. 
it was big enough to fit my 20 ounce cork sickle and I am a water girly like I have to have my water bottle so I really enjoyed this pocket being big enough for a water bottle the other thing that I like is the shoe compartment I am also a person that my shoes cannot touch my clothes so I love having this shoe compartment as an option um, the next thing that I like, obviously, you know, I enjoy that hidden pocket on the trolley sleeve, but the next thing I like about this bag is there are so many compartments. It's not, I'm not going to show you cause it'll be hard to see since it's black, but there is a full zip pocket. I've done full reviews on all these bags. I'll link those too, if you want to check them out. But, um, I do enjoy being able to organize things. Now, here is my one gripe about this bag, and you probably already know what I'm going to say. I don't like that there is not a dedicated laptop sleeve. Now, devil's advocate, you could, I, and I know I'm probably going to get this comment, but I know people have told me you can use this front pocket as a laptop sleeve, or you can use this inside pocket as a laptop sleeve. My only issue with that is that I'm often traveling with a work laptop, so a laptop that does not belong to me, and I don't know that I feel comfortable enough to put it in either of those spaces, just knowing that it's not mine and I truthfully don't want to have to pay for it if something happens. So that is my one gripe about this bag. If this had a dedicated laptop sleeve, um, I would be absolutely thrilled with this bag. This would hit every check mark. It would be 10 out of 10. But I, for me, that is my issue. Instead of this mesh pocket, I think that would be a nice spot for a laptop sleeve because you don't want to lose your storage spaces in the other pockets. That is just my personal opinion, my personal preference. Um, maybe if I wasn't traveling often with a work laptop, it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but that is the one thing that I do not like about this bag. Um, this bag is in the oatmeal color. Um, would I purchase this again? I would purchase the bag again. I don't know that I would purchase the oatmeal color again. Um, I haven't had any issues with these getting dirty um, or anything like that, but I just prefer the chocolate color to the oatmeal. Again, personal preference. All right, so those are my thoughts after traveling with three, these three bags. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please you know, feel free to reach out. I do my best to answer all questions, comments, whatever. Um, and then I also have a code in the description box. It's not really a code, it's a link um, for I think $25 off of your CalPAC purchase. So definitely check that out. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So if it doesn't, don't feel like you have to keep trying. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Um, check out my other content and I will see you all in my next video.